When you start using Roman Cart, you're going to want to select exactly what you want your cart to look like to your customers. You can either choose from one of our predefined templates, or you or your web designer can design a template just for you. So let's take a look at how to uh, choose uh, one of our predefined templates right now. So this is uh, an example website that we've created here. This is for Jeeves uh, Stylish Ties Online, and it's a simple HTML website uh, with Add to Basket buttons linking to Roman Cart. So if we just move to the control panel for this uh, for this cart, and then the first thing we need to do is make sure that we've got our company logo uploaded, because some of the templates are going to use that to uh, make it really match your website. So if we click on configure company logo, I'm just going to look for my company logo, upload jeeves.jpg. Okay, that's uploaded uh, the company logo. We're using just the top section of, of our website for this, in fact. Uh, and then you click on Configure, Appearance, Hosted Cart Pages, and Shopping Cart Templates. So there's a few different uh, options here. You can either choose the standard templates, which are the, your website templates, or the templates uh, for mobile devices, or if you've created your own templates, they'll appear in the user template section. So I'll click on standard templates. So as you can see, you're shown the templates which you can select. You can page through those templates at the bottom to see all the ones which are available, and you can select them by using these four buttons, uh, which select that cart template for use in different scenarios with Roman carts. So if you want to use them on your website, then you click on the web button, uh, if you want your mobile users to see uh, this particular cart, then you click on mobile. If you're using Roman Cart Storefront and you want to use the cart for that, then you click on Storefront. And if you're using Roman Cart for a Facebook store, then you can click on that button there. So we're just going to choose this uh, this blue template just here, and I'll click on Web. So that's so our website customers are going to use that cart there. Um, so there's also a copy button on the in the action column so if you want to create your own template then you simply click on the copy button that copies that particular template to the user area it saves you having to create one from scratch you can just choose one that uh, has been predefined and then modify that to your own requirements you can design one from scratch if you like but copying an existing one makes it a lot easier so we've chosen that template there now let's just go back to our website and see what that looks like so if I add something to the basket you can see that we've got a blue template there with our logo at the top, uh, our buttons down the bottom. If I proceed to the checkout, it displays the items in our basket, and you can enter your name and address there. The templates can all look different, um, so just choose the template that you want to use on your own shopping cart.